No, oh, it's so beautiful out. Nothing can ruin this perfect day. It's the most perfect day in the whole world. Everything just couldn't be better. I don't know what I'm going to do with this glorious day, but I'm definitely going to do something. Absolutely nothing can ruin things now. Oh, what a perfect, perfect day. And, oh... The mermaid's not here today. He, I think he's doing something. At, oh, J J J Jasper's not here either. He, he's away, and Davy Duck is doing something. I, oh, there's nothing for me to do. What a beautiful day, and I've got nothing to do. The sun is shining. Oh, my phone. <laughs> Hello, Baby Duck speaking. Am I to help you? Oh, hey, Jeff. Hey, long time no talk. I guess. Uh, well, well, okay, that's a bit rude. Just cut me off there. Well, okay, okay. What's going on, Jeff? How are you? Uh huh. Uh huh. What do you mean I gotta get down to the police station? Why, why would I want to get down to the police station? I'm not in trouble. Uh-huh. Okay, okay. All right, well, look, you just gotta give me five minutes to get there. My car is broken, so I gotta drive. I I'll see you there, Jeff. Hmm, that was weird. There was Jeff on the phone, and he sounded extremely worried. He said, I have to get down to the police station, and something, an emergency is happening. I gotta, I gotta get down to the police station, and I have to see what's going on. Yeah, well, not to worry. Come on, baby. Look, let's get down to that police station. I'm sure everything is just fine. Jeff is just being dramatic. Oh, my gosh. I know what it is. They're going to be throwing me a party. Oh, this is amazing. This is the most amazing thing in the world. They're going to be throwing me a party. Come on, baby. Look, let's go down to the police station. Here it is. This is the police station right here. Hmm, Jeff, where are you? Jeff, why is Jeff not here? Jeff normally stands right here. I remember the first time I ever met Jeff. I was walking out here, and his fucking is nervous. Psst, come here, come here. And he was just here. So why is he not here right now? Oh, that, oh maybe he's inside. He said there's lots of trouble. So Jeff, hello. Jeff, hello, sir. Hello, lady, sir. Jeff, Jeff. Why is Jeff not around here? He told me to meet him here. He said he's here. So I said I'll be there. And, and, and now he's not here. And I'm not there. Oh, well, uh, Jeff. Where, where could he be, mate? Would he be up the side? I, I doubt he would. He said he'd meet me here, so I think he should be right here. <laughs> Maybe I should stand here and wait on him, but I don't really want to because I need to see him. I need to speak to him. He said it's a big emergency. And I don't like big emergencies. They skip. Oh, Jeff. There you are up there, you big silly Billy. What are you doing so far up? But that car is the exact same as my car, except it's not my car. Hey, buddy! So you said there's a big emergency and I have to get here straight away and I have to be really quickly. Blah, 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 blah. Jeff, what did you want me here for? What is the issue here? Good job, take nine hours to get here. I rang you like 20 minutes ago, you said you'd be five minutes. What's all that about, huh? We needed you here ages ago. Baby, look, there's a big, big problem here, buddy. Your mom is after being arrested. Oh, this isn't good. We don't know what we're gonna do. We don't know how we're gonna get her out. <laughs> Baby, look, this is terrible. She's after being arrested again. What? What do you mean, Jeff? She's after being arrested. What did she do now? Oh, goodness. Last time she faked her own kidnapping and she got arrested. Oh, what could she possibly have done this time? I know she definitely didn't fake her own kidnapping because I only seen her like yesterday or the day before when I was hanging out with, with uh, my little brother. So what could have possibly happened? Oh, gosh. Jeff, not all this again. I can't go through this. What did she do this time? Well... Baby, like, apparently, they came over to our house. I wasn't there. They came over to our house, and they arrested her. They said that she she's a suspect, and they have evidence that she killed your stepmom. Now, baby, like, between me and you, I know it was you who done it. I seen it. So I don't know they have, how they have evidence. Baby, look, I, I think somebody's trying to frame your mom and saying she did this. We all know it was you, but I don't know how we're going to get her out of here. Can't be true. I killed my stepmom. I don't want to say it too loud in case there's any cops anywhere. Oh gosh, there's there's cops just out here, so I can't say anything too loud. But I killed my stepmom, Jeff. We both know that. My mom knows that. Gosh, even my pop knows that. Everybody knows that except for the cops. Somebody must be trying to frame her. But who would try frame my mom? Why would anybody want to do that? This is suspicious, Jeff. I don't know if I like this. Well, baby duck, word on the street is. Team Elitas are back around. Yeah, your stepmom was the leader of Team Elitas, but it turns out they're actually back around. So I don't know what's gonna happen, Baby Duck, with them. 
We, oh, it's, it's a strange one. They're back, and I think it might have been them who tried to frame your mom. Which, well, baby duck, if it was them, these are going to be a dangerous group, and they're going to be looking for revenge on you, your mom, basically everybody involved with you and your mom. So we got to be careful about this, baby duck. Yeah, you're right, Jeff. We got to be careful. Team Elitists are a bad bunch of people. They really are. They're the worst kind of people going. But you know what, Jeff? You leave it with me. I'll do some investigating. You do some investigating. And, well, you ring Desperate Dan and get in touch with him. And I'll go speak to the police, see what I can find out. I'll speak to you later, Jeff. And, hey, remember, stay handsome. Oh, gosh, that's terrible. My mom is in the prison. This is the worst day of my life. How could my mom be stuck in prison? She's stuck in there with no food, no water, no lawyer, no nothing. And all because Team Elitus are trying to frame her. She didn't even kill them. Oh, she didn't kill my stepmom. We all know it was me. Okay, let me go in and see if I can see my mom at least. I'll shut these doors over so the police don't give out to me. Hey, hey Mr. Officer. It's, it's me. It's Baby Duck. Uh, I suppose I don't need to tell you what I'm doing here. Um, I guess you already heard about my mom. Oh, hey, Baby Duck. What's going on? Uh, it's nice to see you. Um, yeah, I guess you're here over your mom. Look, baby, look, we, we can't tell you anything about your mom. We've been told specifically to say nothing about your mom. And that's all I can say on that matter. She she isn't even in this prison at this police station at the moment. You know, we don't have that many cells. Baby, look, I'm not able to say anything about your mom. She She's over in the big prison as far as I know. But I'm sorry, baby, look, that's all I can tell you. Really? Really, Mr. Policeman? After all we've been through, everything me and you have been through together, and you go and tell me this, you tell me you can't do anything for me, well, I just don't believe you, I think that's a load of poop, mister, I'm not your buddy anymore, I tell you, I will not! Be your buddy. That's for sure. I'm gonna go up to that big police station and they'll tell me everything. I thought we were friends and you were supposed to like me. But evidently I was wrong. I'm going over to the big police station near the prison and I'm gonna find out some information about my mom. Do you hear me? And they're gonna tell me everything I need to know. Gosh, the cheek of him. He is so rude not telling me. Come on, baby. Look, let's get to that prison and we'll find out some information about your mom. Oh, I thought my days at this place were done. I thought, you know what, baby duck? You finally got your life together. You don't have to come back to these stinking places anymore. And what goes in Evans? Not even a month after. And you're back here, huh? Hey, sir. Wait, why are you looking at me suspiciously? Okay, whoa. Whoa, he's walking towards me. There's all the prisoners. I, I'm not going in with them. They're all crazy. Well, all them prisoners are nuts. I'm not going in with them. They'll just beat me up so much. I, I can't do this. Okay, where's the man? Hey, Mr. Reception Man, Mr. Reception Guy of the Prison. I want to get in and see my mommy. So you tell me what cell she's in because I am going to speak to her immediately. Hello, uh, baby duck. No, no, you're not going in to see your mother. No, you're, I have a warrant for your arrest if you step one foot inside that prison. I was told that you will definitely arrive here because that's the kind of person you are. But I was also told that if you arrive, I am to tell you there is a warrant for your arrest if you step into prison. I can tell you some information about your mother, but only if you promise me that you will not step foot in the prison. Okay, okay, mister. I promise I won't step foot in the prison. Technically, this is the prison, and my feet aren't in there just yet. Ooh, if I get a jetpack, I could fly. <gasps> Ooh, that could work. No, 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 that won't work. That won't work. Mommy! Mommy! Mom! Mommy! Oh, she's not there. Okay. Okay, Mr. Reception Man. I promise you I will not go into that prison. But you have to tell me information about my mother immediately. I want to know everything you know, and I want to know when she'll be getting out of prison. Is that comprende? Very well, you have obliged. That is very noble of you. I was told that you are quite a hard man to bargain with, and you will probably still end up going in. But... Baby Duck, I was going to tell you everything about your mother. So, your mother is in solitary confinement at the moment, and she is due to be sentenced to death, 
probably within the next week, because we have hard evidence that she killed your stepmother, I believe. Wow, that's quite a pickle for you and your family. But yes, your mother is in solitary confinement and will be sentenced to death. Goodbye! Hey everybody, what's going on? Thanks so much for watching today's awesome adventure with me, Baby Duck! Oh goodness, you guys, did you hear what that reception man just told me? Oh, it was the worst news I've ever heard in my life! My mom is sentenced to death, and she didn't even commit the crime. It was actually me! Oh gosh, guys, I don't know what I'm gonna do, I don't know how I'm gonna get my mom out. Comment below, what I should do? Should I break her out, or should I look for evidence to prove she's innocent? But guys, if you did like today's adventure, make sure you hit that like button! And if you do want to see more Baby Duck, you guys, make sure you hit the subscribe button if you're not subscribed. But I gotta go, so thanks for watching! watching you guys!